Oh, to know the warm embrace of a pyro user. Deha? No, not that one. Deluke? Definitely not him. Hi, it's me, your favorite Hu Tao enthusiast, and I'm sure you're tired of every reason of why Hu Tao mains are better than you videos. And you know what? I'm sick of not having C6 Hu Tao, so clearly nobody's happy here. Honestly, I'm just a silly little Hu Tao main looking for her big Zhongli daddy to shield. Paimon thinks that maybe you might be reading a little too into things. I mean, my Hu Tao <laughs> is, she's got some crowns on her. <laughs> she's got her weapon, she's a max friendship, and this is where I put her fucking outfit if we had one. <laughs> And here we go to visit my hotel in the house I've confined her to, and she can never leave. Oh, um, just one second. <laughs> there we go. Sorry about that. <laughs> Forgot to, you know, make sure the hotel is out. <laughs> Raiden Queen, I'm so sorry. Ayaka, she's too stiff. She's too needy. Too much attention and I cringe every single time. I take one misstep on her rotation and I lose 50k damage! Please! Deha? Uh, I don't want to talk about Deha. Let's just say if there were two buttons that I could press and one of them was to buff Hu Tao and the other one was to buff Deha, I would press the <laughs> Hu Tao button every single fucking time. Anytime, anytime, any place. If my life fucking depended on it, I would hit that Hu Tao button, please. <laughs> buff my queen. <laughs> but Hu Tao, she's perfect. She's literally failure proof. She's so low maintenance, just pick flowers for her every day. Murder flowers for her too. Simply easy to do. And don't just stop at 80. No, you have to get her to 90. You have to prove to her that she means the world to you. You have to prove how much you love her. And don't listen to those people that say you don't have to max her skills. You don't have to get her to 90. Like, are you really gonna listen to somebody that's never had a waifu before? Because I wouldn't. They've never had a waifu. You're really going to listen to somebody that's never loved a fictional character? Or even the same fictional character as you? I don't know, just sounds sus to me. Now, I'm sure I already know what you're thinking, and it's pretty much, there's no way that you've perished as you tell a thousand times. And you're right. They don't pay me enough for that. Quite frankly, YouTube doesn't pay me at all. Hi, hello. You can definitely change that, by the way. <laughs> so that it never happens again. Zero view, uh, Andy. Shut the fuck up. This is mainly a showcase. You know, a testament. An understanding that I will always preach your Tao supremacy. And by showcase, I mean my hotel, she's... I mean, you don't really need to see her stats, do you? You want me to show everything again? Yes. Oh, absolutely not. Um, if you didn't see the first time, I'm sorry. <laughs> you know, I, I could maybe go back if, if you bribed me, but I'm good. Ah uh, yes, have you tried Milady's Precious Cooking? You should really try it. It leaves you just on the very edge of the clasp of life. <laughs> and as you know, the lower the better for her. What better than for her personality to bring you to your own personal funeral as well as her own? Through her food, she will guide you into the afterlife. She is the funeral director after all. And trust me, she can direct me anywhere. And I hope that you can feel the same way.